How's it going guys? My name is Eric Van Wilderman and welcome back to Geometry Dash. In this video we're going to be doing a level called Verity by Serpunge, which is really neat because it's a level that's dedicated to me and Merg. Merg is an upcoming Geometry Dash YouTuber who does other hard games as well. Very cool. I'll put the link to his channel in the description down below. He's getting very good very quickly. He's really dedicated to games because um, he's done other hard games like I've done like Super Hexagon and stuff like that. So he loves doing uh, challenges and stuff, uh, which is really neat neat so anyways um this level is it says insane right now but it's not yet rated it's gonna be rated demon eventually the level is pretty much an easy demon up until the very end and the very end uh gets pretty tricky but up until then it's not too bad but the end has like kind of a tricky rocket section and uh, my controller keeps on disconnecting great very strange indeed anyways let's just get going here um yep yeah, i'm pretty good one percent there's a little dedication to michigan right there obviously yeah Mm. I haven't played with the actual song yet, which is really cool. Well, I didn't realize it was gonna be like a lyrical song. That's neat. Oh my god, the decoration on this is- it's so cool. It is a really, really cool looking level, by the way, guys. I have played it in practice. But it's so cool gonna be able to play with the music is gonna be so awesome. Until I die like a million times at the end and then, you know. But hey. Wow, look at that. That's so neat. Up in the air we go. Whoa, sorry, I have to focus there. I mean, mini wave parts are the bane of my existence. I always have to focus super hard on mini wave parts. It's just the way of the world, okay? Mini wave demands focus, not memorization. Just complete and utter focus. I'm living the dream. That is so cool. I like the way the decor does that. Oh my god! That's so cool looking. Okay, here we go. Oh, jump! Oh, too early! I always prematurely go. That sucks. A lot of my problems actually in this game are, it's not pressing a button too late. I mean, sometimes I die when I press a button too late, but it's usually like in anticipation, I press the button uh, way too early. So maybe I just gotta stop doing that. I just gotta calm myself a little bit. Here we go. There we go. And then you press, you do the, Green jump ring, and you can just hold down the jump button there. Jump in the air. One, two, three. Boom, wow! Up in the air we go. Okay, steady yourself, steady yourself. One, two, three, four. Oh, too late. You gotta make sure when you're the, the cube, you jump up and you land on top of that thing, the little structure, and then you jump again. So I jumped a little too late there. I thought I would go too early in many places, but I was a little too late. I think I should have practiced my transitions a little more on this level. I've put in like 200 to 300 attempts already. I do over practice things a lot. Like I practice like a bunch before I record because I want the recording to go smoothly. <laughs> I should um maybe like show my first reaction to the level, but whatever. Whatevs. Okay, here we go. Boom, all the way, baby. All the way up. Jump. See, that's it goes to the music, right? Oh, super duper early there. Oh, Jesus, I went too late there. Holy shit. I at least I got, four, I got 43% that time. Oh, yeah, making big progress. There we go. That's how you do it. Okay, focus. Come on. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, yeah, keep it going. Oh, good, 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 good. Jump, 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 jump. Okay, good, good. Now we got a little bit of peace and quiet, but... We gotta calm our tits a little bit here because we gotta do mini jump. Mini jump! There we go. Mm. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Oh! 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 Oh no! It's it's beautiful, but you gotta do a tiny little jump there. I always... I did that a little bit in practice mode where, you know, you gotta do two little tiny jumps again when you're upside down, but I would, uh... The first one, I think I have more room than I do, and I just jump into the, the ceiling, which is the ground because we're reverse. Okay, wow. That was really stupid. That was my chance. But anyways, after that is like the hard part. Um, so once I get there, it's all about just a matter of if I can get through this tough rocket section. There's some crazy tight sections you gotta get through. Okay, I got back here again on the next attempt. Let's see if I can calm myself down a little bit, okay? Okay, mini jump, mini jump! Oh yeah, we're going baby, we're going. Here we go. Go, get the coin, yeah, good. Oh, here we go. Hard part, baby. This part's really cool. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, good. We're going. We got that. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh. 
Oh. Oh no! I hit the roof! God, I was... I thought I was gonna get that. I was like, oh my god, I'm doing it! I'm going pretty straight! And then I just... I literally tapped the spike on the roof. It was probably about 0 .001 of a centimeter. Oh! Oh! Oh shit, I went too low! No! Because it's tricky because the way the portals work is you go through the portal and then uh, you kind of let go and you float to the next one a little bit. You just bounce into it, but then it all of a sudden changes where you don't just kind of like float into the next one. You actually got to press it so you go downwards. Um, and that one was the one I was on, but I gave it too much throttle and I just like plummeted to the ground. Oh, damn, I thought I was going to do it that time. Oh, poop. Are you ready for some badassery? Almost messed up there. Wow. Yeah! I got it. Oh my god! I totally thought I was gonna die on that last coin at some point. <laughs> I'm so glad I got that. Oh yeah. Man, that was sketching me out. Holy shit, I totally thought I was gonna die. Holy shit. Woo! Stress gone! Yes, that last flying part. You know, um, I gotta say, the last flying part, it was tricky to me when I was doing it in practice mode, but I think it's just because I needed to practice stuff like that. Like, it's been a while since I've practiced, like, a bunch of crazy, um, portal switching rocket ship segments. And, uh, you know, I felt like I was getting better at it at that point. I mean, every level you do in this game, you feel like you're improving in some way if you're playing a variety of different levels, right? Like, you know, all those nine circles levels I did, it helped me with the wave. This helped me with some portal changing with some ships. Um, so that's cool. Wow, I really liked it. Verity by Serpunge is a very cool level. Now, I'm going to talk a little bit about the Geometry Ash community. I love the Geometry Ash community, and, uh, when I first started this game, I didn't even really know about the community. I was like just playing the main Rob Top levels and I was like, yeah, this is fun. Geometry Dash, it's great. It's like the impossible game. And then I started to get more into it and I was like, holy shit, there is a huge community here. Um, you know, a game that I really like to play uh, back in the day, I still do sometimes, is Little Big Planet. And Little Big Planet had some user created levels and they have a community too. Um, and so I was really surprised to see that Geometry Dash, this game has a community. I mean, this game's even, uh, probably I would, dare to say that this game has a bigger community than Little Big Planet, and I just had no idea um, about it. And uh, I didn't think I was actually going to be like a part of it, you know? I was like, I'm just going to play some levels here and there um, because it's fun, right? But all of a sudden, you know, um, people that are creative people, that are creative geniuses, I dare say it, that make these amazing levels in the limits of the level editor, are, you know, dedicating levels to me. Like, I can't believe Sir Punch would dedicate a level to me, and that means the world to me to be like not just an outsider looking into the community but actually a part of the community and I really appreciate uh, every every one of you all the, the viewers of the channel um, everyone in the Geometry Dash community um, it really means a lot to me to be like a part of this you know and um, I think I'm gonna dedicate more time to Geometry Dash from now on like you know I dedicate some time to it but I think I might upload more frequently just because you know when I make a Geometry Dash video, I feel like I'm a part of something. 
Um, when I make other videos, I do too, but especially when I make Geometry Dash videos, I feel like I'm a part of something bigger than myself. And, uh, and I really like that. I really like it a lot. Um, I want to get better at this game, and I want to start doing um, some harder levels and stuff, so... It's gonna take me longer, though. I mean, it takes me longer to learn. I, I'm a slow learner. Um, but, you know, hopefully I'll get up there. But, uh, thank you so much, Punch. That's... It's amazing that you dedicate this to me and Merg. Um, you should check out Merg, too, by the way. Um, he's pretty damn good. You'll be impressed by his skills if you check out his commentary. And, uh, yeah. That's all I really wanted to say. Anyways, leave a like down below. It helps me out immensely. I'll see you in future videos on the channel. And as always, guys, peace.